What's up, everybody, and welcome back to the Bogey Smalls channel. And we're back at Hickory Hollow Golf Club where I broke 90, and where I'm here, I'm trying to chase 85. So I didn't get my tee shot as there was a group of about 11 guys that let me play through, being that I was alone. So a little nervous to pull the camera out, but things starting out good. Here's my second shot. Here's my pitch up. It felt good, too, to hit that drive on the tee shot because I rifled one right down the middle. One of the guys told me, you better do that for the next 17 holes. <laughs> Here's my putt. I leave it short. So my theme all season has been two putt. I know you guys know. On to hole two, so I'm plus one. This is hole two, 487 yard, par five. Here's my drive. So I'd hit this drive just left of the fairway. If this is your first time here checking out the channel, we post content every Monday and every Thursday. Please hit the likes up button and also subscribe. We'd love to have you as part of the team. So after this shot, the remaining shots of this, I wasn't able to pull off of the GoPro. So I would end up pitching up and two putting for six. Here's par 335 yard, hole three. So I had a great tee shot left of the flag here, coming up for my putt for birdie. And I'm short. Second putt. Just misses and now I'm three putting on a par three. So hole four is a hard dog leg left. Instead of hitting driver, I hit three iron off the tee. I ended up hitting this a little bit further than I wanted to, setting me up for my approach shot into the green. And I top it. So I guess one good thing about topping the ball is just making sure it goes straight. So that would set me up for this uh, pitch shot on. So that looked right at the flag but was actually took a horrible bounce for me. Here's my putt. So I rolled this right past him, man. And these greens were, you know, very hard to read all throughout the day. So two putt and we're on to the next hole, which is a uh, par five, 513 yards. And I would end up clipping the tree here and falling short. So now I'm hitting this three hybrid that I trust so much. Nice, great shot. I hit this thing really well. I really like this club. So just short of the sand trap, trying to pitch on. I think I run through on the back side of the green. So now I'm putting off of the fringe. Not too bad, but leave it short. Onto my nickname. I should change my nickname to two putt. All things considered on that hole, I'll take that two putt. <laughs> Wouldn't get the drive on this next shot, but I'd end up topping my drive, taking the second shot, hitting a nice clean shot, and then pitching on a little bit over the green. And I'd finally get on here, but I had a bad nice putt, camera nice angle. <laughs> I thought I'd make this putt, but once again, two putt. Thank you. So on to hole seven, par four, 400 yards, sitting at plus seven. Here's my drive. Ooh. So shot tracer doesn't wow. show up, but you can hear the guys that I'm playing with. I'd hit off the tree and it would bounce all the way on the right side. 
Here's my second shot in. I'm hitting the three hybrid again. After giving this club so much praise, I top it. So I'd punch myself back into the fairway. Here's my next shot in. And this, I just put a little bit too much muscle in it. Went over the green, pitching up from the back side of the green. So bad angle on the pitch, I would end up pitching up perfectly for a little tap in. Ooh, nice. So sitting plus nine, here's hole eight, it's par four, 371 yards. Here's my drive. Nice rip. There you go. That's a good one. Hell yeah. Damn, nice. And I got a good bounce. So beautiful drive, hitting to left side of the fairway, trying to get on in two. So I'd hit the green here and it would end up rolling off to the left side. Here's my pitch on. Not too bad. Man, if I could just string together these. So here I'm two putting again. So here we go, finishing out the front nine. This is uh, hole number nine, par three, 166 yards. Here's my tee shot. There you go, get there. So this wouldn't quite make it over the water. I would take my drop for one pitch on to the fringe here. And I would hit this beauty of a putt and just leave it about two nice feet putt. short. Nice putt. Man, well there you go guys. I ended up going 11 over on the front nine and I think my focus needs to change from trying to now break or get to 85 and actually start to think about breaking 90 consistently. I think that's my next step here. So tune in on Thursday to part two as I take on the back nine and we'll see how I finish out. Thanks everyone and continue to live your life above par.